Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome back to my channel. Today, gosh, it's been so long since uh, the last time I um, recorded something without voiceover that I feel kind of awkward and kind of new to this, but hopefully everything goes okay. So I just want to share with you or show you how I make my own or how I'm going to be making my own nude polish. There's a lot of nude polishes. Um, but it's real hard to find the one that suits your own skin tone when you see something it happens to me all the time like I see somebody with a really beautiful um, Nude nail polish online and I like them. I like how they look under like nails But I go to the store and I buy them and then try them on my own nails Turns out it's like too pink for me too yellow for me to that or to this on my own nails because everybody has their own like skin tone and just undertones and it's real complicated to just get it right based on what you see on other people so i saw this beautiful nude polish bear it all this in my hands and my nails is too strong it looks like a foundation so I, when i swatched it i was like if this was only two shades lighter and then i thought well i can do that i can make it uh, lighter with some white but in order to do that i need a an empty container an empty bottle of polish and this is just an empty what is it a base coat and i'm just going to mix and those two in here so i can have my own nude polish i think this is perfect for you know any skin tone and you're gonna add as much white as you need to Okay, the first thing that I want to do is work over something that um, piece of paper or just a napkin. Then I'm just going to open my bottle here. So I'm just going to most of it. And then I'm just going to go with this one. And I'm going to be using less of this one because as I mentioned before, I want my mixture to be more um, you know on the lighter side. Just go by eye. Okay, that's it. I'm just going to cover this guys up. Okay, and to mix it, before I shake the whole thing, I'm just going to go with a toothpick and kind of like help just mix. And then I'm just going to cover this thing and I'm just going to shake it pretty well until everything is combined. Here is what I have so far. And to be honest, I'm comparing this to this one. This one I bought, it was like super cheap and I like the color. But this one takes like five coats to just achieve this this shade and you have to be there for a while so i don't have the patience for that but i love the shade so i'm just going to you know work on my mixture to just create this color yeah it's a bit too white so i'm just going to add more of my nude and you can customize it to whatever like how how um dark or how light you want it to be I'm just going to cover it mix it and i'll be right back to show you the color and as you go, you're going to find out you're going to be coming, you know, back and forth, adding more of this. But I highly suggest you to save something of white, just in case you have you go too far with this one and it's like too dark for you. You can always um, add more white. Trying to color as you go, and yeah, uh, trying to find a nude color that that works for you. So I'm just going to stop here because I love the shape, and I don't really know if you can see, but I used that much of this one and I'm not really sure I can't tell how much of this one but I used quite a bit and just to show you to compare with this one I think it looks pretty close to it and the, the best part about it is that this one only took one coat okay just to compare I just have a few other nudes this is the one that I created right now and this is ASE Santropis this turns out too gray for my skin tone. This is one of the examples that I want to share that every um, in every other like nails online it looks great but in mine it doesn't. And then I have this one, I love it, but it takes like three coats to get this shade. Plus it takes forever to dry for me because I'm really impatient. And then I have this one, the one that I showed you before. So just to compare so you can see, yes, I'm just going to do my nails so you can see the pigmentation. I'm not wearing any base coat because sometimes I'm just too lazy to to apply it and the good thing about this one is that I know that it's going to dry fast because that brand from Sally Hansen or that line is super fast so that's why I chose this um, 
brand to make this combination. So you can customize it to your own skin. So I just want to show you, this is one coat. It took like five minutes to dry. So you have to apply a second coat because there are some spaces like here and here. And this is two coats and after five minutes it's dry. The application might not be the best because the application pretty much depends on the brush that you're using. And since I was using a brush, um, not my favorite one, I prefer bigger ones. So if you have like an empty bottle of nail polish that has a bigger brush, your application most likely is gonna be better. Yeah, I just wanted to share this idea or just um, this way to, you know, you can customize your own nail polishes. Doesn't have to be nude, but I figured it's like the hardest nail polish to find for me. Thank you for watching. Hope you find this uh, video helpful. Don't forget to comment, share this one, and subscribe for more stuff. I'll talk to you later. Bye guys.